together we can show the world what we can do You are next to me and I'm next to you Push me on through until the battle's won No one's gonna give a thing to us Into each other we put our trust Standing united after the fight is done Yo, what's going on peeps? It is me, the Ninja Reviewer here Time for another exciting review of the One Piece greatness. It's been a while since there's no manga chapter during the week, so at least we got the anime. So that's a start at least. One Piece greatness episode 835 review. Monkey D Luffy right here. But oh man. Oh dude. Alright, alright. While this episode, while this episode right here was actually really 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 great there is there is there is one thing though that i did notice though that i mean it may not bother so many people though but i'll still accept them regardless i mean i don't know i mean at first i didn't really see it either but it's like you know what you know i'll take it as it is it's fine it's the one scene I know everybody has been waiting for for the longest time. And that is the scene where Sanji saves the Vince Smokes. Yes, that one famous scene from the manga where everything was just amazing. There was like a lot of, oh man, there was like a lot of the environment too, especially. Like that was pretty crazy as well. So that was pretty nasty. That was cool. So... So, that right there was pretty neat, so we got that. The animation for this episode, while really good, was really, really great, I should say. Like, good to even great. The one scene where Sanji did his epicness to save the Vinsmoke family. Hmm. I will admit that scene could have been a lot better, though. But, minus that scene alone, we had some really great moments. For example, like, we had pretty much, you know, we had the rest of the Straw Hats, pretty much. Just, you know, like, we ha Oh, yeah, the big mom stuff. The big mom stuff, even at the very end, made this episode clean. Like, the big mom stuff at the end. So, it looks like, you know, we got some... We got some... We got... Pretty much, it's a very simple concept of an episode, okay? Basically, we just have Luffy trying to get to Big Mom with the broken, uh, um, Mother Caramel picture. But, of course, the future boy, my man, Katakuri, tries to step in, tries to stop him. And, of course, same thing with Daifuku, but, of course, he's being distracted by Sanji. You know, still trying to fight him off, etc., etc. So, that was pretty cool, too. I mean, yeah, granted, there were some scenes that did sort of had that dragged out momentness to it. But it wasn't really that bad, though. Like, it really wasn't. Like... And I also love the way, too, how, like, the Vin Smokes were just completely not scared or not, you know, shook at all at the fact that it could possibly be dying. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, that right there was really cool. Even though I wish we could have gotten that incredible, incredible sequence from the manga done justice. Unfortunately, though, that has to be dropped up points a bit from this episode. But regardless, regardless, though. We have that going on, and Capone just doing his best to fight off against uh, Katakuri. And we see that Katakuri reveals more of his multi ability. He's pretty much the better badass version of Monkey D. Luffy. Like, this man can not only see the future, he can stretch like Luffy, he can make attacks like Luffy. Hell, he's even deflected from bullets and shit like that, just like Luffy. So he is definitely the better badass version of Monkey D, obviously. So that was cool. But my favorite part in this episode has to be Brook versus Oven. Like that tease is like, yo! Oh, yo. Listen, 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 listen. Yo! That scene was, oh! But, but the man is top three. Well, at least not yet. He'll prove to be the top three. Well, he is top three, okay? Let's just be real. He, he should be top three, but... Obviously, I mean, okay, granted, at the beginning, we didn't really believe that. Like, Oven was kind of like a little eh, after a while. But, yo, yo, bro, 
Hook just pulled a Gene Kizaragi from... He took it out the playbook from Blaze Blue, Gene Kizaragi, man. Yeah. That's exactly what he is, man. He is Jin Kizaragi. And it's... Yo, it's crazy, man. Yo. Oh, my God. Yo. Woo. Yo, that part right there had me sweating, man. Oh, my God. Yo. Yo, man. Yo. Mmm. Yo, that one scene alone was just straight up nasty. We had Book coming in there. It's like, no, I won't let you do that shit. Because Oven got the picture of Mother Carmel. Nunny. And it's like, Gee. and it's like, yo, that was cool. Yo, I'm sweating just thinking about it. Whoo, yo, Book, man. Even though, listen, listen. To the people who read the manga, this is not canon whatsoever this was only in the anime like i said man the whole cake island arc in the anime is whooping the manga's ass right okay minus that one scene minus that one scene which could have been a whole lot better but you know toei that's classic toei <laughs> always tries to do that but regardless though we had that going on that was cool and i like and i like his little cocky attitude too we was like saying like i will melt the bones off your flesh or look for every barrel. It's like, <laughs> it's like, well, you can't because I'm already bones, bitch. And it's like, oh my god, dude. Oh, mmm, mmm, yo, that was crazy. Oh my god, that was nasty. That was cool. Maybe no, it was that one second. But of course, kind of um, oven could easily melt the temperature and melt the ice. But still, that was cool. And then we had the big scene, the ending, the hockey streak. Even Big News Morgans felt that shit. He was like, ah, like the way they animated that, that was so cool. Because after that, he shows the picture of Mother Carmel finally all broken up. And then already right there, like the earplugs, you know, we got everyone right there. We got Chopper and them getting them ready. Then they did it for the Vin Smokes to save them from the shriek. But everybody else. Nah, screw them. They're already not down from the hockey. And then at the very end, we got a little glimpse of what's to come for the Big Mom flashback, which is going to be next week. I cannot wait for this flashback. I loved it in the manga, and it looks like they might do this scene justice in the anime as well. It looks pretty clean so far. Just from the preview, it looks really clean. Like... Yo, I'll tell you, man. Yo, Toei is really stepping their game up with Whole Cake, minus that one scene. But regardless, though, I'm going to give the episode instead of a 5 out of 5, it gets a 4.5 out of 5. For the fact that that little 5 points off was because of that one freaking scene they could have done right, and they kind of just, like, kind of screwed up. So, yeah, that's it. So, that's it for this week's episode of one piece episode 835 overall a great great plus episode it could have been completely completely fire that one scene alone could have also made a five yo but whatever though 4.5 is still great still a great episode overall let me know your thoughts in the comment section below of this week's episode of one piece episode 835 let me know your thoughts in the comments below don't forget to rate comment and subscribe as always click that bell to join the squad follow my social media plugins i'm a gamer tags as well so peace soul love chicken grease and the sky is the limit and manga fans keep support oh wait, wait no 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 wait hey i messed it up messed it up and the sky god and <laughs> is the limit anime manga fans case the point which we watch you watch see you guys next week for 836 and for the manga folks i'll see you this week for the latest chapter